Emmy winner for Best Newscast. We are continuing to monitor the case very closely, and our hope is that criminal charges will ultimately be filed here. Accusations of cruelty and torture of trapped pigs on Charlotte County Parks and Preserves. PETA, People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, has placed an action alert on their website tonight, shining an international spotlight on Charlotte County. And now a petition started by Charlotte County citizens asking certain employees be fired. Good evening, I'm Warren Wright. Thank you for joining us on Fox 4 News at 10. People in Charlotte County and across the country are speaking up. They say they're tired of the county not responding to charges of animal cruelty. Now, people are turning to the Internet to put pressure on the Charlotte County administration, urging people to join their cause. These photos were turned over to the Florida Fish and Wildlife, showing a Charlotte County employee using a crossbow to kill a trapped pig on county property. Other times, a spear where he stabs them repeatedly. But the animals don't die instantly. Photos showing day will turn into night before the animals stop moving. Zelf Ridgeway is a licensed trapper. And then they're letting them lay in the trap for a day to die and suffer. PETA, People for the Ethical Treatment of Animals, says after a nearly a month of attempting to communicate with Charlotte County administrators, they've decided to post an urgent action alert on their website. Uh, obviously, jabbing at trapped hogs with spears or shooting at them with crossbows is cruel, um, illegal, and unnecessary. PETA representatives say although it wouldn't be their first choice, they respect a community's right to euthanize animals over populating and destroying a wildlife preserve. They just don't want the animal to suffer needlessly. We believe that the photographs depicted indicate that violations of law may have occurred and we would like to see action taken. And so do a lot of other people. There's now a petition circulating on MoveOn.org. The headline screams, stop torturing trapped animals and remove those employees responsible for this immediately. People from all over the country are now speaking out on the issue, saying things like, wow, I sure would not be safe with that lunatic working for the county. I will not be visiting any parks in Port Charlotte anytime soon until he's locked up. And this needs to stop. Hire professionals who will humanely euthanize these animals. Professional trapper Zelf Ridgeway just shakes his head in disbelief. What I saw was just inhumane, and it's against Florida statute. Well, we have received calls this weekend that concerned citizens have gone out to look for the traps and releasing the animals so as to prevent them from being, uh, in their words, tortured. Now, if you'd like more information on the links to the website mentioned in this story, go to fox4now.com and click on the link to this story.